What's going on, car family? 30K Colazo back at you with another video. I actually have my 22nd Andrew Luck auto. I'm about to show you. Um, Andrew Luck was actually the player that got me back into collecting back in 2013. So for about two years, I collected nothing but Andrew Lucks. Maybe a couple TYs here and there, but mainly Andrew Luck. Um, I mean, I went hard pause into Andrew Luck. Um, I have so some of you might remember my early videos. They were all pretty much Andrew Luck videos. Um, I literally have like 20 of each of his rookie cards. And I'm talking about jersey cards, relics, um, all those cards. Um, so it's been a long time since I picked up any of his cards. I kind of got burned out. And uh, when I say I have a lot of his cards, like my Peyton count is like at seven, around 700. My Andrew Luck count is probably over 2,000 easily. So... So what happened was uh, I sold a couple cards recently and I came across this card and I literally paid uh, $18 out of my pocket because I sold off a couple cards. So it was a nice card. Might as well pick it up. Let me, let me show you. It's 2013 Panini Absolute Football. Andrew Lux, 7 out of 10. Just a beautiful looking card. Still got the Panini seal. Number 22. Really happy about this. When I first started collecting Andrew Luck, I actually, um, I like as a kid, I never really collected autographs. I just collected, you know, regular cards. So when I first started collecting his, I just, for about a year, it was just straight um, jersey pieces and relic pieces and uh, just base cards. So around year two, I was like, you know what? Why don't I just, I, I have like 20 of this kind of card. Why don't I just pick up a couple autographs? So then I started collecting autographs. Now I'm at number 22. Can't wait for next year for him to come back. Shout out to the Ripper. Shout out to Eli Hale. Hale's yeah. Seen he did a video today. Glad to see he's back. And appreciate you guys watching. See you guys soon. Peace.